And welcome back to another episode of Warframe with Chill here on my channel on TikTok. I can tell you I am pretty much burnt out from Fall Guys. Um, now I posted a couple of videos of Fall Guys videos here on, on TikTok, but I'll say this. It's very unlikely, and I, again, I don't know for certain, you know, because things could change, but I highly doubt that I will ever be playing that piece of shit game ever again. I hate Fall Guys with an absolute passion at this moment. It is one of the worst games I've ever played. Um, the reason why that is is because it is not a skill-based game. It's mostly luck. Um... If you never played Fall Guys, it's one of those games that looks really comfortable. It looks like a kitty game. Uh, it's mostly where you compete against other players. You're trying, basically almost like a race. You're trying to compete for, I guess, to earn crowns or something like that. You compete in these different, uh, different little games that each uh, they call show has a, uh, in a match. And... I guess you're competing to try to be first or whatever. Um, here's the thing: I've, I'm a very, I can be very, very competitive uh, when it comes to games like that. You know, anything where there's competition, if you're competing against other players, I tend to be very competitive. I want to win. I like to win. And with Fall Guys, whether you win or not is not really based off your skill, you know, most of the time. It's most of the time based off luck. Like, you, you know, you'll be lucky if you win, get managed to win. You'll be probably lucky, you know, probably just be a matter of luck instead of being really good at the game. Um, for example, there's this one... There's one, I guess you call it game or event, you know, kind of mat in the, in the heaven, in the, in the game. I forget what it's called. But you stand on this platform. And the main objective is a survival type sort of game um, event. You're supposed to stand on this platform and the goal is not to fall into the slime. If you fall into the slime, you get eliminated. So you're supposed to, so you're supposed to avoid fall in the slime, stand on the spy for and avoid falling in the slime. While at the same time, you're avoiding getting hit by um, objects shot from the big, the, you know, big cans that shoot at you. You know, big stuff like, you know, different different shaped objects like controller, you know, like a controller or whatever stuff like that. So you're supposed to try to survive and. There's like a time limit, like you know, time count, timer countdown, like you know. And so, I played that. I participated in that, and I thought, you know, so and I didn't get eliminated one bit. Didn't get, well, actually didn't get. I say didn't fall in the slime one bit. I managed to stay on the platform, managed to avoid all the things that got shot at me. Didn't fall on the platform. Didn't fall in the slime or anything like that. Time runs out. I'm thinking I probably would qualify, right? No. I see this being eliminated. How do you get eliminated if I stand up if I'm standing on a fucking platform? If I manage to avoid getting falling into the slime and manage to survive to the couch, you know, to the timer runs out, how did I would I get eliminated? It's garbage. Like, I've lost, there's many times where I've gotten eliminated, like, in the first round or the second round, and, you know, barely can get past the third or fourth round at all. You know, I'd be happy, I would have been happy if I've been able to get, to, like, to the final round and I lose. Okay, fine. i will be like, okay, fine, well, at least I made it to the final round. Like, you know, like, like say, you know, say I'm pretty proud of myself. But... In Fall Guys, you can't, you know, every time it's like every, like, getting eliminated early in, in the rounds, and I kept getting frustrated and frustrated and frustrated. Like, it was so frustrating, you know, and I don't like getting frustrated in the game, you know. 
whether it be if it's a if the chat if a level's being too challenging or whatever, or if the boss is you know just killing me left and right every single time, whatever. I tend to be competitive when it comes to games that have, have competition, like you know, say multiplayer team death matches or free falls or whatever, you know, stuff like that. Fall Guys, I keep, you know, is one of those games where I tend to be very competitive and I don't like losing and that can safely say it's, I kept losing way too many times and I just, especially when I'm trying to play with friend, you know, my roommate, you know, friend of mine, like murdering his girlfriend, I try, you know, it, it sucks when I get eliminated, say they survive, because then I'm just sitting there waiting, you know, for, <coughs> for them to either finish their, their show, either, either for them to win or get eliminated, so I can rejoin, you know, join the squad and start over again. And I always hate that when I got eliminated, because it's like, you know, I'm sitting there doing nothing. And I feel bummed out, because, you know, it's... It, Basically, it just got to the point where the game was no longer any fun, and I just stopped playing. I, I stopped playing, and I probably will not ever play it again. But again, I don't know. But again, that could change, you know, we don't know. But, I mean, it's safe to say I probably won't get back into Fall Guys, because since I just deleted it off my PS5, you know, it's it's a shit game. I mean, really, if, you, if you're over-competitive and you, you know, don't play it. Save yourself the hassle. Save yourself the save yourself the money on having to buy a new controller. Should you rig it out of frustration? Like it's really it's just it's it's not worth playing. It really isn't. But yeah, that's it for this video. I'm gonna start you know if I start another video, probably maybe because post a couple videos I don't know, but. I'll see you soon, but feel free to subscribe, follow me on TikTok for more videos. I'll see you soon.